Hello guys, it's me, VRGXD, and today we're going to be doing a new series, it's going to be called uh, Call of Duty World of War Zombies, and I'm going to be playing custom maps, and this video is kind of, you know, a 200 subscriber special, and firstly I want to say thank you to all my subscribers, uh, I, I recommend you should watch my 200 subscriber special video, your list, your name will be on the list, and I just want to say this map is called Casino. As you can see with the casino, the, with the casino accessories and items and everything. And I found this map on Custom Zombie Modding, the, that website. I recommend go, I recommend you go check it out if you have World of War Zombies. And I'm telling you now, this, uh, this Zombies map was made beautifully. As you've seen, we, we just spawned in an elevator. And they all just come at you and there's like one dog all the time. And I'm going to go ahead and buy the Gooer 45, is it? The Gooer 45, because this gun is a beast at the start. A beast from the east, one shot headshot, get you a lot of points. As you can see, I'm just spawning the headshot. It's a beautiful gun. And I just want to say sorry that the gameplay is not in um, a widescreen resolution. It's like, it's just a square, but you know, it's okay. It's gameplay, it looks amazing. It's it's a new series, it's a start to a new series and you know it's <coughs> it's quite good so uh, round 3 we're doing pretty okay, I haven't got down yet and I was going to say I get pretty lucky in this game this is not really a live recording as you can see here, 666 some devil illuminati conspiracy there so I'm going to get the gear red, we should get gold claims from headshots, luckily got a kill there I'm telling you now, I've got a confession, I actually really do love zombies. I'm starting to prefer, to prefer it more than Minecraft to be honest, because, you know, it's just, with zombies it's so fun, and it's a challenge, and this is a challenge for me, I nearly got double hit there, fortunately survived, so I'm just going to go run away, if I get double hit, I'm basically dead, and I don't know why I'm doing that, oh my god, see that, I got double hit, but for some reason I didn't die, usually it's two hits, one death, but, I guess God was with me then, so I'm just going to go ahead and get these double points, get some more points so I can open the doors and go to my final destination, get a headshot and miss, my accuracy isn't that special in this game, just a beginner, don't worry, there's a perfect one there, and there's another perfect two headshots, so we are on round four already, I have no downs, even if, if, if I die, I'm just dead anyway, so I'm going to head off in this round, but first we need to try and survive to get as much points as we can and then we're going to start moving. And this map, I'm going to talk to you about it. The map is beautifully created. Everything is just perfect to the touch. With all the other, what's it called, those casino games at the side. With the yellow, uh, yellow was it, roof and the carpet flooring. It's really pretty, it just makes it look like an actual casino. It just makes you like want to play. The, look at everything, the floor has got that roulette thing, it's just amazing and it's just so fun. It's such a fun map, it's really small and luckily I got out of there. Oh, what am I doing in that corner? So this map, it's, you know, it's quite small but that's, it's a challenge, that's the problem with it. It's so small you you like just have a problem. And if you do have all the World at War Zombies and if you do have COD at WoW on your PC, then go ahead and check the description and the the map link will be there, all you have to do is download it, put it in your mods file, and you're ready to play a new custom map. So I'm going to do is leave two zombies alone. I do not want to leave one, simply because leaving one zombie will make it run, it'll change it to a runner. I'm going to open the doors, and as you can see, oh, we got a nice little room with two statues, with uh, three doors, and a window. We're going to open this room as well, and pack a bunch on the below on the stairs, if you can see it. Some speed cola, I'm gonna go up the stairs. And we have the pool, the pool room, and we're out we're in the city. So we're gonna go ahead and open the power, that's beautiful. Now the oh, that's, you can hear that noise as well, some nice nice little zombies. And that teleporter will teleport you to the pack punch room. And if you don't know where the pack punch room is, then you'll see below now. It's usually here. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and go back to our place. And hopefully, you know, sweat it out. The Thompson on the wall there, some speed cola, that is. Is it speed cola? Oh, that was root, double tap root beer then. Up there, and f oh, I made a mess. And now what I'm going to do is just knife him away. You know, just to quickly finish it over, open this door, try and get jugger. And see, as soon as you kill one, they die. And here I fell, I thought, you know, I've got enough points. 
Oh, it didn't work. It did not work. So I'm going to try and get 2,500. But just, just, just no luck. And amazingly, the box is there, so I'm going to give myself a cheeky go. And we get the double sword shotgun. And why is this better than the normal sword shotgun? Because it's longer. The longer it is, the better. I'm just going to buy myself a Thompson because I've got no ammo in my Gua. Gua, is that you say? And there's the pack punch machine. So I'm going to go up and just, uh, try a new strategy. See how long I can survive with this strategy for. See, this has got a beautiful one shot kill with this gun. So I'm going to survive off with it in these early rounds. See how good I go. Oh. Gameplay, and as you can see, the zombies are wearing some next level casino crap, wearing some casino clothing, which is I really do love it. And if anyone suggests any more maps that I should do or anything, just message comment, and I'll I'll, I'll gladly do the map. And here we have just insta kill, so we're gonna knife them away. We no need no need to shoot, no need to waste ammo. Just gonna keep knifing and on. Ooh, we've got double points as well, so we go just just. We're only gonna shoot where we can't knife because we want to knife like that. But now we have to shoot him, so now we can knife him. Because if we don't shoot him, then he'll just hit us. It's a simple, you know, zombie maneuvering that you just have to do to like try and survive. And right now I'm having I'm having like so much fun with this. <clears throat> you know, with his zombies experience. I recently brought Call of Duty World at War, like last week. And, you know, I played the campaign. It wasn't special. I liked it. It was okay. It wasn't the best. And then I decided zombies. But zombies are absolutely adored. I played Nash Nash the Totten, which I've had experience from on my iPad. So I'm kidding. And I have played um, the, the other three. I played The Rise. That one was a cheeky, cheeky, cheeky map. I did not know where to go at the start. I was stuck. And I just died, I played the one where you were like outside somewhere. So anyway, we're gonna go buy go ahead and buy some jugger bugger, jugger juggernaut, so now four hits then I'm dead, four five hits then death. I'm gonna go on the box, what do I get? Come on, come on. Ooh, monkeys, but for some reason guys I don't actually don't know how to like deploy the monkeys. Because it's G to throw a grenade, but to throw a monkey I'll have I just not have a clue. So as we as we killed him, he turned into a fast runner, and we're just gonna run away from him now. Ah, uh, there we go. Let's kill him as soon as he comes around the corner. Bam! Ah, oh, why are you so silly? And there's the pack of munch if you've seen it. And I'm locked up in this episode. I should have went to the pack of munch at the end, but I just completely messed up. You'll see what happens. So basically, I'm gonna try another. Uh, well, I'll say all this at the end. I'm sat, I'm speaking to earlier, and there's the textures of a, a man on a horse. A man on a horse. And here I'm just checking out my FPS. My FPS drops to like 2 FPS when I look down, and he goes back up. When I look up, and as soon as I've done that, I looked up and I nearly got killed. Amazingly, I survived this, this drought of zombies. And luckily, 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 surviving. I've got an amazing amount of luck through this game. And he just didn't want to die, and then he got I took two kills, three, four hits there. I took, I got four hits, but amazingly, luckily didn't die. I'm just going to go ahead and take all the points, get all the kills. There's a nuke there, so we can't go that way, so we're going to go this way and flank him. Don't get killed. Be careful. Luckily, again, created that gap. Luckily, that gap just came, and it was enough for me to squeeze in and get the nuke which has got me some more points and uh, we, we are on wave 7 you know the zombies are, the, the stakes are rising now I really need to you know get start getting another gun because this short off shotgun hasn't got enough ammo for me to survive as much and now it's dogs, dogs, nobody likes dogs even though you know as soon as you see dogs as soon as you see dogs you know where max ammo is coming and that's when you know that's when you know it's it's a it's a nice battle for us. So we're gonna keep it going. We're gonna keep it going. We're gonna keep killing these dogs. And for some reason, my PC is frozen on me. Oh, here we go. It's back. It's back. It's back. Don't worry. I'm gonna keep getting dogs. Switch to my Thompson. Boom. Gonna keep going. Killing these dogs. 
and nobody likes dogs, I hate them, you couldn't eat amazingly survive a lot of bullets, and I'm gonna hate to turn, like, eat the fire off, for some reason you just turn the fire off, and shoot him in the freaking shopping chair, sit down, big boy. There we go, I'm gonna kill him. So the next map I'm gonna be playing, guys, is the same map, the casino map, I'm gonna play it again, there's my camera, that's what you wanna see. I'm gonna be playing the casino map again, simply because I think I can do better, I know I can do better, and I really want to pack a, pack a bunch for you guys to show you the pack a bunch guns as they have like amazing camo. So I'm going to give this map another try for you. And then after that I'm going to be trying like another map. I think I'm going to be trying Area 51. It's this alien map created by some randomers which was really talented. And it was extremely fun. So right now we're going to get the shot off shotgun and try and kill as many people as we can. get people, zombies. And as soon as we miss, it's still gone wrong. This is when you know you've gone wrong and you leave your spot and you miss a sh Oh my god. And keep trying to survive with this gun. Hopefully, the one shot kills don't end. And I'm stuck in a corner. I'm stuck in a corner. Oh my god, I survived. I told you, the, the tremendous amount of luck I've been getting is incredible. Okay, kill them all. Come on. And you got cheeky bypasser here. Now I've got max ammo. How do I get out? Oh my gosh, I'm completely lucky. It's gonna go get go ahead and get some points, but I'm trying to be careful. Oh, squeeze for that gap amazingly again. I don't think I can survive with any more of this. This luck. And I'm stuck again. But amazingly trying I just get out as well. So I'm gonna go kill go ahead and kill this kid here. Oh no, we're not. <coughs> now we are glocking up at 5,000 points. It's time to pack a bunch, but I don't. I just completely fail. And there's the last two zombies, hopefully. We're gonna walk away from them. We really need to go get another gun. <coughs> so we're gonna go head away to the pack a punch. Not the, not the pack a punch, the box. See what, see what gun we get, see how lucky we get. Hopefully, I wanna get lucky. So we're just gonna run forward, come on, come on. Slowly approach the box. Let's see what we get. Okay, so we've got. Here we go. The moment of truth. We have a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful browning. This is one of my favourite guns in this game. The amount of bullets it consists is just completely amazing. The amount of bullets we get from the browning is beautiful. The amount of points we'll get is beautiful. The amount of just sexiness we'll get. Is absolutely gorgeous. Look at it, 500 bullets. I imagine how many points you could freaking experience from that. So now we're nearly on 5k. I'm gonna. I should. I should have. Should. 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 It's pack point. We're gonna use this big boy. It's beautiful. It looks. The aiming. Your sexiness. I love it. Don't know why I'm trying to reload, but I shouldn't really be trying. You can only be trying when I'm alone. And to be honest, I'm not going to get my alone time in a long, long, long time. So I look at them points. I've got 4,200, I think. I'm going to reload now. And here we go. I get trapped. I've trapped, basically just trapped myself in here. Not looking where I'm going. Trying to reload. And how the hell I made that? I'll never ever know. So we're just trying to reload. And we're trapped. We're trapped. We can Ah, oh, and that's it guys. So thanks for watching guys, we may be up to today. And thanks for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Goodbye.